what's going on y'all what is going on thank you for choosing once again to click on my channel this is oya oy i'm simply here to do my job keep the messages to the collective how are you guys how is everybody thank you everybody that's been liking sharing support supporting subscribing to the channel welcome all new subscribers i'm just gonna pull I have three cards that are on the table and um, someone's sister is going to speak up on a case. Um, somebody's sister could actually been used as a false witness um, to lie on them and make statements that's coming against them and their children. Okay, and this is a time where you're going to have to be stronger than ever because when you realize things are played out like this, need to come against you spiritually. You most definitely want to take that time to heal and focus on healing your children. Um, they most definitely could be going through something, having to deal with you know, being played with by people that don't have any comp compassion for people. And um, I don't know why I got that somebody's sister is about to speak up on a case or they may actually have been a false witness in your case. Please, guys, only take what resonates. I'm only here to give it to you if you can have it. We are all stars in our own show, but this may or may not be for you. Yeah. So somebody's sister could have been doing something with their social security number or your child's social security number, okay? A lot of things are coming to the light because they have to be fixed in order for us to move forward, okay? And this is all collectively on a higher vibration. This is why you're starting to see that, you know, a lot of things have to be torn down to be rebuilt. Truth is being revealed to you about who your enemies actually are or who it is that people that you need to have some away from you and your children, Okay? Yeah, somebody could have did something against somebody to either have a house or keep a house. Okay, whether well, this person used your social security number or this house is actually supposed to go to you. Okay, this is what's this is what's going on, you guys. Okay, but you most definitely you want to forgive and move forward and just you know keep shining on when it comes to certain shit like this because I tell you people will try you simply because they seem like they feel like you have a good heart or you're a good person so they're gonna try to use you up you know. Go as far as they can go. But a lot of us are not stupid. <laughs> you know, most definitely some people do things um, to you because you allow them to do it over to you. This could be because you want to see how far a person is, where they'll go with it. Or you could just be just harassing to a person. But just know when it comes to like moving forward, you don't have to have these people in your life. You can most definitely wish them well and whatever they want to do and get done in their life. But... Most definitely, you're going to see people getting that collar. So if a person's a dog, a dog is a dog. Okay? A dog is a dog. So you got loose limbs. Somebody's falling apart. Okay? Somebody's falling apart here. Because they was doing something against somebody. Okay? This also could have been somebody that uh, was doing something in a past life. Okay? They wanted you to actually love them. Um properly or they was going to try to stop you and whatever it is that you was doing so basically this is a person you know they have love for you but it's conditional love it's what you do for them and if you're going to be there to like stroke their ego and all that shit or when they complain if you constantly are letting this person complain or rub their energy off or whatever you are to this person if, if you stop doing that then they was going to completely just stop fucking with you or loving you but and come against you okay so it's also coming in out that um Somebody's co-worker or boss, um, no, this is, yeah, co-worker or boss took a payment. They could have did something with your social security number, okay, and now a practitioner is in regret. So it's like a chain game. If people are connected to a lot of things that have been coming against you, most definitely everybody's going to get their karma when it's time for the shit to fall down. Yeah, so you got sticky situations, okay, third-party situations. Um, hidden and it came out hidden enemies are being revealed to you right now so you need to trust and believe also consecrate fast and keep an open mind and heart because when you realize that the betrayal of trust didn't happen to at least eight people that are around you okay even you could have been caught up in a third party situation you didn't know about um, <clears throat> you don't see some looks like a lot of people that was thinking you was a meal ticket here It's also enemies that have been sleeping with enemies. Yeah, a lot of people have paid off. Like, here we go with this shit. Somebody was paid off to do what? They didn't know God was real, though. So it was a doctor here that was paid off. 
So most definitely, like in my own situation, I noticed that they do. They cause so much conflict, and then it's like they have certain, you know, people, whether it's police, doctors, lawyers, judges, or whatever. They didn't already pay these people off to come and get you some type of way. So this is why a lot of people are under judgment. But there is a hospital out here uh, that uh, probably got paid off if it wasn't to like give a false, you know, psychological exam result or something. Somebody was supposed to be paid off in a hospital pertaining to somebody. Yeah, because somebody um, wanted you to be diagnosed with some type of uh, cognitive, cognitive disorder. They wanted your brain. They wanted you to say that you was under some type of, you know, delusion. But these people didn't have no loyalty. It's like. You know, there's a lot of people going on. It's like somebody's trying to help hold somebody for ransom, too. You got somebody that's also just trying to hold somebody for ransom. This is almost not like not letting you go until you give them a certain amount of money. So, you know, it's almost like you got away before everybody got their belly full. Yeah, you got connected to the Holy Spirit. Too. So somebody got connected to the Holy Spirit, you know. You are you have a personality, you got control over your mind, your thoughts. Okay, you're able to spring and like bounce back. Okay, but somebody was still connected to karmic too. And um, these people was paying each other to lay with them. Yeah, they was already generational generics. So these are basically people that, you know, they don't really know they self, so they running around doing the most. A lot of them didn't have clean blood. Something about their blood too. I've been getting a lot, like a lot of blood. Yeah, something's changing here. They got the weather's changing too. Sunny days. Sunny days. Yeah, sunny days coming. You also have a, a, a Caucasian woman and a white man that was assisting with uh, legal kidnapping. Like I said, they were using their money. So it's basically telling you the courts is infested with these people to do whatever these rituals are, spell work. Okay, a lot of them was paid off. This is why they want to go through what they're going through. Yeah, a lot of people, whoever was paid off, a lot of these people, they was paid off uh, to keep property, a lot of property. It's a lot of property coming up, a lot of deeds. Um, it's like some, it's almost this torment of the people when they mental to the point where somebody didn't realize who they was for the longest time. And it's like now everything's coming to you all at once. Okay, so you guys see a lot coming out. Yeah, now they blaming. Okay, that's another cognitive disorder. Some of these people are now starting to blame each other or blame somebody for what they've been doing. You got southern smoke came out. Okay, somebody could be a Scorpio or uh, somebody could uh, have a birthday in November. Somebody's been having night sweats. Okay, it's almost like people are, uh, you know. While you having your ascension symptoms, like I said, it's not you being sick. It's not you being sick. It's your body actually changing, you know, to be able to receive the downloads that's coming in, you know, to meet your highest self. It's like while you going through this, somebody can't sleep. Yeah, you being told to take time to yourself. So you get ready to see that a lot of things is an illusion, blowing um, smoke, smoke and mirrors, illusions, like for the past three months, somebody has been, like, under some type of illusion. Yeah, it was a rich bitch. So, you got a rich bitch that's doing spell work. Somebody is spoiled. And they use their money to do a lot of different stuff. They also work with mirror, through mirror magic. So, your sister could be rich for real. She's spoiled. Never really had to work for nothing. Um, she could work for the government or has worked in the government agency. Yeah, now they're trying to run around and get paperwork in order because a lot of things are being revealed. So somebody that worked in the government agency or has been assisted by somebody in the government agency, they're running around trying to get paperwork in order because things are being questioned. Okay, things that was happening on your life. You also got traffic tickets. Somebody could be getting tra tra traffic tickets. I also told y'all I got like traveling checks. Um... Some, a lot of people are getting caught up with their own shit because they're trying to do something. Okay, you're also being told to uh, check your cell phone. Yeah, but you're being told you're a prayer warrior. 
Jamil are no longer racialized to us. We have thought protection, which gives you clarity and insight. You get messages of the gods, strong spiritual connection, foresight. Yeah, you being empowered here. This is also like the rise of the phoenix. Somebody's coming up out of something. Somebody, like I said, was trying to hold you for ransom. It was like they were trying to use all your money and then let you go. Yeah. Somebody could be in Alabama State, around Alabama. Yeah, somebody's going to jail, though, it, whether it's mentally, physically, or spiritually, because they was, like, using a lot of beauty spells, coming against the royal people. Yeah, you've been told the power is in your mind. You can most definitely create whatever it is you want. Like I said, they want to have a, a war on your mental. Some people are being watched. They was hired. Um, there's a hired investigation. Okay, a lot of the people are, are like upset about what they're finding out. They see that there's an ending leading to a new beginning here. So it's most definitely an ending leading to a new beginning. And all these spells are not working. Yeah, people are going on a transformational journey. It's literally like a purge going on. Um, and the stolen land and property came back out again. So it's saying humbug. It's a cosmic accept a true or valid what is false or invalid. So a lot of people, you know, was accepting a lot of falsehoods. And now it's like the truth has to be revealed in order for people to understand, you know. And it's not language. It's not the spell work that they've been using. It's almost like people are going to be seeing symbols and signs, synchronicities, like different things from the heavens there. Okay, you also got that a lot of people was tied up, um, slept with their friends. A lot of people was tied up with each other, power hungry, but they didn't have a hustle. Okay, they was taken from me. Yeah, somebody's actually a fucking cult leader. Somebody's a leader of a cult out here. Your sister could be a leader of a cult. Okay, she was getting checks on your children. So she was trying to get your child to be diagnosed with something, like I said, okay? And then conditional love came out. So conditional love, check on your children, held for ransom. Someone could even be caught up in the courts with their child just simply because your sister may have been involved. What? That says a lot. Okay. But these people was power hungry. Yeah, they were doing a lot of hard work. I don't know why they was taking so much from your, your uh, bank. Somebody could have been taking money out of your bank account. You not know it. Y'all make, make sure y'all check your statements. Stay on your money. Because you are being told, turn them off and leave them off. Somebody's trying to come back in, though, with a message. Okay, because they see it could even been like a stepsister or somebody was involved, a stepmom involved. I heard a fake prince. Yeah, so heal from all your trauma, okay? All your trauma, heal from it. This could also prevent some type of loss of a child. You could be under stress. Okay, just learn to like focus only on the positives. Do not focus on anything negative. Find any way to turn negativity into positivity, guys. This is basically you having the power of your mind to change your perspective. Okay, everything is what you make it. Yeah, whoever the, all these people was intertwined, they going through something. It's also like I said, somebody's over a mysterious ministry. Whoever this cult leader is, they do a lot of war on people on the deep end. Okay, it's also tapes and videos that's coming out. Somebody's like like trying to pack up and leave, y'all. They're trying to pack up and leave because they know some type of tapes and videos that's out or something. Yeah. Somebody could have been even on meth or doing drugs. Somebody could have had um, their drugs tamper with. Yeah, you being told to spread positivity. Okay, shout out to my cousin. I love you. Uh, you have spiritual teacher and leader here. Oh my goodness. This is just too hot for me. Yeah, you have spiritual teacher and leader here. 717. Yeah, somebody um could have been eating solid food. Lucy the leech. Can somebody clear everything? You can uh, you know, clear all the clairvoyance and Everything. 
Come together and work with your soul tab. You being told to work with your soul tab and take your power back. Okay? Focus on your children. You could be a high priest or a high priestess. You're saying somebody was trying to set up a lick. See, you got a uh, robbery and hit a lick. Someone you know. So your sister could have been involved with a robbery or somebody you know. Yeah, but you free. Okay? You free. You could be in California going through something at your job. Um, getting ready to get some truth that's going to hurt you. This could be simply pertaining to your bloodline, who you are. Just talk about it, okay? Don't keep it in. Somebody could also be in witness protection. Yeah, because somebody could be protected from somebody that's really like an animal here. Um, this person has ancestral emotions, okay? They're dependent upon you and your who you are. Yeah, so somebody could have been playing in the courts with having to do with child support. Um, these people was trying to be a puppet master over your life, but it's it's coming out. Your sister has no remorse. She knows about everything that's going on. Okay, checkmate. 